Hey everyone, and we're back with some more XCOM Enemy Within. My old save file got completely corrupted and deleted when I was messing around on my computer with Steam and stuff. Ah. And bad things happened. But this time I'm joined by... You go first. <laughs> Took a bacon? <laughs> that would be too spicy again. Cool. And we are going to be playing a completely new map. And we are going to do second wave options. Which second wave options should I have this time? Um, I, I I'd almost want you to do save scumming. Save scumming? Yeah. Let's go with training roulette if you have that one. Training roulette. Damage roulette. Good thing or oh, bad. training roulette. Training roulette. Mostly right. No, uh, no. I haven't I haven't finished a playthrough of Enemy Within yet, so I don't want to mess with it too much because still don't know the genetics and the mech trooper stuff. Mech trooper stuff is awesome. Let's do hidden potential. That's Not one. created equally. Not created Should I do equally. new con new economy or leave it? I don't know. Let's what? leave it. You select not equally. You created Martin Luther King will be very disappointed. Oh, <laughs> Martin Luther King is very Absolutely. disappointed in me. Very Absolutely disappointed. critical is good. Uh, Absolutely critical is good wow. unless there's an alien. <laughs> I didn't. I don't remember most of the enemy within ones. Absolutely critical as a flanking shot will guarantee a critical hit. For both sides, though. So don't yep. alien said. Yeah, I imagine that's, that's actually gonna fuck you over more than it's gonna fuck over them. Psionics can only be learned by interrogating a psionic alien. Great or good. Uh, let's get aiming angles. Should I do absolutely critical? Yes. Okay. I don't know. Okay, well, there you go. I have a little options. more challenge. Back, and let's start. No, I don't want to enable the tutorial. We've played this game before. <laughs> many, many, many times. Yes, Tony, you can give me a game or two real quick. Go ahead. I just might not be able to open it yet, because I'm recording. Those who play with the devil's toys will be brought by digress to we degrees to wield his sword. I am bad at reading today. That must be a pretty cool sword, though. Yeah, probably. Explosions. And everybody on YouTube is going to see the intro again. <laughs> yeah, intro again. Yep. Many, many intros again. The answer is always yes. Always give the Scarlet Many, many the intros gifts. in a galaxy far, far away. Galaxy far, far away. And then the everybody galaxy far, dies. far away, but it's right here on Earth. Yep. <laughs> oh, super, the Devil's Toys. Bunk Minster Fueler. I don't know what that is. Well, it is technically sort of magnetic toy after him. It is technically a galaxy far, far away because we are far away from somewhere. And then everybody yeah, the, the, gets the, covered in alien goo. They're gonna put recordings of your uh, let's play here onto a you know a satellite and launch it into space. As a part of the STI program, however. <laughs> Why? Why mine? It's your, it's your it's the cultural best, significance. The best let's play. Gotta put, put, put that quality on right? incursion. Sure. Council of Nations we got a cutscene. To approve oh, that's the activation of the XCOM project. You like have we haven't seen this before. This <laughs> to oversee our first and last line of defense. Dun, 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 dun. Your efforts will have considerable influence. Oh, Scarlet, you have company in the restarting category. What? We urge you to you have company in the restarting category. Does that mean? What? Oh, it means I'm going to die it. twice as much. Oh. And Nem lost his file for XCOM, so he's got to start over too. Good luck, Commander. Good luck, Commander. XCOM. Enemy Commander. within. Enemy within. Yep. We are the men in black. Excuse you, I'm a woman. So oh. come up a little. We are the men and women in black. There, there you go. go. Good boy. Let's do South America like my original playthrough on Twitch. I always chose Africa. Well, eventually you get authorities have just requested launch our satellites over so Africa and you'll get next. their benefit anyway. Well, I always just did it. Well, that and it's because it's like 
I don't know. I felt it was very central like, uh, in the middle of the world. But it's not. Like, in, uh, but it's really not. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like it is. Because it the, the planet is a sphere. It is a sphere. It's true. <laughs> Are yes, sure technically, technically it's centrally located if you look at a flat map, but you can mix that flat map around and then, you know, America, or Strike South one. America this is center. Central. That's you true, but I mean, like, you go east or west, I feel like it'd be, like, Don't almost the same distance going east or west. There are far too many penises in this party. We're all American in this call. Should we be the center of the world? <laughs> well, I mean, a lot of maps back then had Britter in the center of the world. So. But, um, Tish. <laughs> I'm just trying to, you know... Multiculturalism it up. Sure, why not? Oh god, you it's know, been forever since whole, I played uh, this game. You know, I have every human origin theory in Africa, you know. Trying 21st century stuff. That's affirmative. Seriously, there's three dudes on this team. This this is too many dudes. Flight of the Valkyries! Oh god, I can't remember how to play this game. Uh, you right-click stuff. That's how you There's play. more buttons than that. Heading out. Pretty sure that's the only button you need. <laughs> you use gun on alien, and hopefully it explodes. Hopefully. And then when it doesn't, you die horribly. Don't die. It's a good, it's a good uh, oh, yeah. tip. Don't die. Oh, I'm not going to die. I'm the commander. I'm not allowed to die. You'll probably die. The two people who are immune from death in this Let's Play are Ronnie and me. Yes, Commander. Are you gonna make yourself in the game? Of course I am. Yeah, that's what I thought. I usually do. Which is weird, because you're both in the squad and you're the commander. I'm just commanding the squad around. Either from the hospital or in person. From the hospital. Well, this woman missed. Horribly. Terrible, I mean, terrible, terrible. But absolutely horrible. Horrible. Tisk, 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 tisk. Alright, watch it. Yeah, watch no it again. No play of this will be complete without Gary sitting in the hospital for months at a time. <laughs> That's what yes. For. Gary will forever be in the hospital. Uh oh. Uh oh. Do doing his uh -oh. hand and arm exercises. Run, honey, run! Make it sound like he's doing Pilates or something in their hospital. <laughs> We've gotta get to the meld! We've got to get to the meld! Meld's gotta get to you. No! I wanna get to the meld! Actually, let's move this over here so I can see the chat easier. There we go, so I'm not looking so far over. I'm flagging one of them! But we need to get to the meld. Can anybody get to the meld in one turn? Nobody can get to the meld in one turn. Shit. Maybe you can sprint it. No, not even a sprint. No, because then you can't do a uh, you can't do a command. Still, so they, they, they changed that an enemy with it. Used to be if you like needed to open a door or hit a button, you could do it after sprinting. Yep. Not no more. Alien object in sight. I'm gonna shoot an alien. Alien just jumped right into flanking position. What? You turned on that crit thing, right? Yeah. Well, I found the other. I found the other meld, so now we have to hightail it over there to get that one. Valen, I am talking. Valen. No, no, that's, that's not even German. Shut up, Valen. Yeah. Oh, right, it's Valen, not Valen, isn't it? <laughs> I don't know. I blame me being American. I have a. I've heard some German accents while I'm here. Not enough though. Even yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that Arnold Schwarzenegger? I could break into it, but I was doing it. I thought Arnold Schwarzenegger was Austrian. They keep yes. walking Very into a flaking position. What is wrong with these guys? Pretty bad. What the team are the aliens? The aliens! Fun. They're literally walking into flanking position. Hold our new alien overlords Get killing the themselves. It's too easy. I don't understand. It gives me a 80% chance to hit them. 
and a crit. And a hundred percent chance to crit, yeah. Like Yasuo, it's a different game though. Yes, sir. I'm gonna dash. We need to get to that meld. The meld will be mine. Yeah, just get all that meld. It's like sell it on eBay. All yep. that creamy meld. Uh, you? <laughs> So I got you, you mailed for uh, Valentine's Day. You'll find me in the mail in a couple days. <laughs> That's icky. I hope you like it. I bought it from the store down the block. Cost Did me like oh, happy mark okay, though. Get Cost me like thirty quid though. So you better like it. There we go. We got the meld. I have collected the meld. Yasso is not OP. Yasso sucks. I know. I'm a Yasso man. There's a giant server room here. Probably got tons of like nerd games on it. <laughs> on the move. I don't know. It was probably your mother. You were saying? No, it says, uh, I think I started in the Let's Play of this a long time ago. Like, I recorded one episode, but I never uploaded it, so I kind of uh, just stopped doing it. I've still technically got an episode on my, uh... I'm on it, Commander. On my computer, it's just I didn't have another episode to, like, oh, do the oh, outro, no. to do the outro with, because of the way I do outros, so I haven't uploaded it yet. Bonus footage. That's Steam Headquarters. Yeah, <laughs> Unless I'm... Cape Newell is probably around here somewhere. I might just montage it as bonus footage. Bonus footage. Much like my oven uploaded uh, optional <laughs> bosses for my Dark Souls 2 Let's Play. Okay, so there's aliens in that direction. Good to know. Kitty with a bow tie. obviously did hear something. Why not a kitty with a bow? On the move. And a bow tie. Run, you bastard. The mom jokes are out. Moving out. Oh, mom is so fat. Did you back up? The mama jokes beep, are out. Beep, beep. What? You know, like a truck. You back up a truck. It goes beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep, beep. beep, beep aliens? Beep. Nope, no aliens. Double time. Hey! No, 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 no. Oh, good. Hey. The, the screen moved over as I was clicking on a space because one of my guys heard something. <laughs> no, please don't send me into that room. Uh, I think it's kind of hard to do, uh, or is the word, uh, accidental commands in this, I think. I hope so, because those get people killed. I think it is, really. Um, I know what that's like. I'm sure, I know you do. You've been resurrected time and time again. <laughs> so many bacons. Duke of female, crispy bacon. Duke's big bacon. I found the aliens. <laughs> if only I could do a let's play of this. Okay, I'm gonna do something that could be hilarious. Moving out. Or it could go horribly wrong. Or it could go horribly wrong. Can I throw a frag grenade in there? Come on. I can! Yes, I got into a position where I can hit both of them. Both! You are good to instruct your men to exercise restraint when no. using explosives. We are not exercising any restraint, effective at killing. Stra restraint? Yes, restraint. I'm bad at I'm bad at English. Your mom is so fat when she walks Commander past the TV, the you miss the entire Commander series. Ah, uh, ha ha. Got it. Reference oh, understood. No. Your mama chats <laughs> in the chat. Or your mama jokes in the chat. Welcome to XCOM HQ, Commander. Well, this is so old. I'm I can't Central believe Officer Bradford. Had a TV show My role in this project is twofold. Providing tactical support for our field. Oh no, people are going crazy with Moobot commands in the chat. <laughs> My then, Boom uh, is not a Moobot command. Wish it was. That'd be a great command. We have a soldier waiting I will come up with some funny is things. like, our Valen is like, it. don't blow the aliens. What, are you, are you on their side? Valen, you spy? Shut up. I like blowing it. things up. Like, Valen, you, you will hug them into submission. Ooh. Valen, wow. Guys, guys, like guys, 
Right off the bat, we got a female sniper. Our snipers specialize in dealing massive amounts of damage. Guess who that's gonna be? Without sufficient training. Unleash the white haired ponytail. Yep. Glitch ponytail. The assault. It doesn't. It still glitches a little bit, but it doesn't glitch nearly as much in this game. Last one's out. It, it doesn't glitch as much and makes me sad. But I am talking. Shut up. We'll get started as soon as you give the order, Commander. Yeah, Commander, got one burn. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know where that one is going. I'm too tired to do impersonations, I think. Solid copy. Yes, Commander. Oh my god! This person actually has the ponytail and has the face I usually use. As well uh, as being a sniper automatically. It's, a, it's as if it was destiny. Good it is go. destiny. Solid copy. Yes, Commander. Got it covered. Yes, Commander. Okay, that one. We're white. Wait, no, that was my face. Um... Skin color, pale as hell, because I'm pale as hell. I don't look that pale. I need to find the correct hairstyle. I think it's this one, but we won't know until it starts glitching. I just just put helmets on all of my soldiers. I don't know why. Why? Why would you do that? I don't know. I kind of like that Oops. ODST thing from Halo, like how they look. Commander so I'm really going for that kind of look. Commander to the research Also, labs. helmets are practical if you want to survive. <laughs> No, that's Ronnie's hairstyle. There we go. This is my hairstyle for now. Yeah, it doesn't glitch as much as it did in the original video. I might have to upload um, some footage of XCOM Enemy Unknown just to showcase that, because that glitch was amazing. You're just going to edit the hair into every video you do. Commander yes! To the research labs. Commander to the research labs. No, I like that one more. Let's get some armor tinting going on here. White as hell. Can I get something that's even more white as hell? Because if anybody hasn't noticed, my favorite color is sheet white. I, oh, enough. I did not know that. I thought your favorite color was red. Oh, ha ha ha. I honestly did. <laughs> I'm also, I think that's the Australian flag? So that apparently is Australian I'm Australian. Flag. Yeah, I'm Australian. Australian. Okay, so we've got an American dude. Who should this be? Should this be Necro or one of you guys? Or Leon? The real American hero. Let's make it Duke. Duke? Yes, this is, uh, Duke, you're going to be an assault, which means you're going to be a frontline warrior. Let's see how far you survive. I have to have guy hair, too. Guile hair? Go to the research labs when I'm ready. Let's make you... Polish. You are now Polish. But not a Polish whore. Polish. His last name, like, Winkowski. You're Polish and you're Asian. And... A Polish Asian person, that's just I gotta find the guile hair. Come on, where is it? No, those are hats. That's a lot of hats. There's guile hair. Toby oh, oops, Grant. That's what I say many more, though. Oh my god, I was gonna give you this one, but I won't. I'll give you guile hair because you said guile hair. <laughs> Let's see here. Let's make it. Sonic Boom. Green. And they'll give you a neck beard. And beefy armor. It will be bright green. To research labs. Commander to the research lab. Honey, I'm busy! Shut up, nurse! What? Hey, what? <laughs> oh, Tony sent me a gift and then it caused Steam to pop up. I'll get that later. Tony, what are you doing? Interrupting my video, Tony! Interrupting the great professionalism going on here. Yeah, I'm so professional. Very much so. There we like go. We now, have, we now have a Duke of Bacon. And I'm getting him out of that shotgun because screw the shotguns. Uh, ah, Commander. I was wondering when you'd be stopping by. Welcome to engineering. Anything they can dream up in the research labs, we can build it here. Cool. I Speaking like the which, engineering guy. Dr. Valen has just sent us some new schematics. Oh, well, With your approval, oh, we Shen. Can begin fabrication. Shen? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He, he's yeah. so grandfathery. He's, uh, in a lot of stuff. I remember him casual. mostly from, uh, he was in Lost. Commander to the so, like, research he was? Of, really? Commander yeah, he's like, um, labs. like five episodes or something. Ah. And one of the Hello, Commander. Like, more important My characters on the Dr. show Vaughan. is his son. I oversee the research yeah. labs. This is Hello. where all I'm of Dr. XCOM's Morgan research and, and development takes place. Whatever. Yeah. We have already begun analyzing the artifacts recovered from our first encounter with the aliens. With the Based aliens. on our preliminary findings, we believe we can use them to develop some new equipment for our soldiers. 
With cool. your approval, we will begin research immediately. Of course, Valen. Yes, Tony wants to be in this video so badly. Oh, well, there he is. So. <laughs> yep. Claim to fame. Mission accomplished. Good job. Uh, I'd say 15 minutes of fame, but I don't know how long Scarlet's going to make each video. Our have to put their own if she makes 15-minute videos, it takes one minute. Good news for Tony, then. To Thanks for Tony. Valen reminds me of... Erlen Hansen from StarCraft 2. Man, that's a really obscure reference. Ugh, I still can't go to the Situation Room. Damn it! You'll get turned into a monster if you make a specific choice in the story. Oh dear. Zerg! Got objections! Commander, we picked up multiple they requests go. for assistance. We'll stop them in darkness. Are marked on the hollow globe. Stop hmm. the aliens from doing stuff. So the do we want stop money? Do we want money, engineering, or scientists? I... I feel like you'd want it. Engineers? I don't know. We'll flip a coin to figure this out. <laughs> Best. You guys Best are supposed to be my advisors! <laughs> I haven't played this game in a long time. <laughs> We're going to Canada. Oh. Canada. Oh, oh. Canada. Canada. Boost meat and craft dinner, here we come. Ooh. Yeah, where's those Customize. mooses at? Customize. Load out, damn it. There we go. A boot. Eh? Hey. Okay, for some reason I've got a rookie in the knee position and this needs to be corrected. There we go. Vancouver? You're going out to Vancouver, eh? Okay. Duke, right until we until me. we get Ronnie, you're my you're second in command. Well GG Duke, I knew you will. No. It's a dirty job, someone's gotta do it. No. <laughs> Fighting can We have any chicks? Oh there we go! Oh we got two British chicks! Let's do that. Yes! So many females. Girl power, it's like, uh, Charlie's Angels or something. Exactly! Except with less dudes. I've never watched an episode <laughs> of that before. Okay, let's launch the mission! Oh. Blame Canada! <laughs> Damn it, Tony, we're not gonna blame Canada, it's not Canada's fault. I'll blame Canada, I'll do it for you. A lot of resistance lives on. Strike once. <laughs> the drop site for this operation will be in Canada. Cool. Rookie Brown and Rookie Walker. Like Walker, Texas Ranger. <laughs> That's a sketch. Cool. Like, what is that sketch? It's uh, Kirk Chuck Norris. It's, a it's good show. sketch because I say it's sketch. It's Chuck go. Norris. Chuck Norris is not sketch. <sighs> Chuck Norris is great. Chuck Norris is extremely sketch. Chuck Norris saved America from the Great Polar Bear War of 2034. Chuck Norris is also extremely conservative. <laughs> yes. Oh, that's where it's coming from. <laughs> Gratuitous political content. Yep. Okay. Please, please mute your video if you're uh, <laughs> political sensibility. Let me just are... call all my business friends and tell them, hey, go Scarlet Stream. <laughs> Let me go find my, like, my low-key white friends. Shush. It's okay, I'm liberal. It's cool. Alright. Socialism is awesome. Okay, I gotta hunker down. down. I took one of those tests where it was like, what you political spectrum are you? And I was like, super left. And I was like, damn. I didn't know I was that far left. Yes, kill it! Kill it dead! Kill it dead, Bacon! Oh, you I, killed it! I went to a uni in which everyone in the community thinks just breeds communists by way. the boatload. Oh, I mean because you're like in the hipster college? Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I can see that. Yeah, you know, a big statue of Lennon on campus that we all uh, poke around each day. Do you like worship like shots? A giant statue of Lennon, really? <laughs> really, guys? Oh, you got March in the three with your red flag. Carry a pickaxe as well. <laughs> and it's um the sickle in oh, the great. hammer and the sickle. The hammer and the sickle, yeah. Hammer Guys, the somebody uh, aggroed the meld. Aggroed the meld. Yep. Now we have to rush to the meld. The yeah, Before the meld goes hammer and sickles over hamburgers, unless the beef is raised in an organic manner, you know, fair trade, uh, feed and everything, and humanely killed. I'm <laughs> a dude. 
I didn't really beat him, but there was a dude in my cement, one of my class of last cement, 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 whatever. Well, he was like, bacon missed. Yeah, bacon noob. Damn it, bacon. He was like 1,010% conservative. It was hilarious. Like, I'm pretty sure he would suck on the Reagan's dick. 1,010% conservative? Yeah, he was so conservative. It was hilarious. Like, we that's, were watching a Michael Moore documentary and he was so mad. That's real conservative. <laughs> it was hilarious. He was like, man, this documentary is fucking bullshit. I hate Michael Moore. <laughs> I don't even know who Michael Moore is. He's a American uh, political activist slash uh, independent filmmaker who makes like a bunch of documentaries that make conservatives look bad. So well, you would probably really like him. We oh, he, he aggroed, did bullets for Columbine and uh, Fahrenheit 9/11. We aggroed the other meld. Yeah, aggroed the other nice meld. Yeah, I feel to. like you you would like a Michael Moore documentary. Watch it sometime. <laughs> I think I have one. Of those I didn't books. mean to aggro the other meld. It was an no. accident. Shit happens. It was an accident. Copy that. If you close your eyes and say peekaboo, they can't see you. Really? I hope so. <laughs> if you can't see them, they can't see you. It's exactly. okay. We we've got time to get to it. <laughs> Yeah, we've got five turns to get to that meld. We're good. We good, we good, we good. We good, we good, bruh. We good, bruh. Yeah. Bruh. We good, bruh. On it. That's a better position there. Run, 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 run. Putting Duke of Bacon right out in the middle of things, like usual. Nice cat and father. I'm going to try not to get you killed, Duke, I swear. You should make that like a Again. challenge, like another iron task, whatever. You just don't get Duke killed. Uh oh. Yeah, the, uh oh. We'll be contacting uh -oh. Steam for an achievement. Official. Yep. Oh, oh thank like, god they missed. Sounds like a good plan. Duke, somebody just got a flanking shot off on you. I draw when. Draw on that bow tie, good kitty, Sherry. Bow tie. But now you're gonna shoot him in the face, right? Right? Right. I just got out smart. You just shot him in the Go face, on, it's okay. Dang. Leon got bodied by Daffy Duck. Cut out smarted by a duck. <laughs> yes, you did. Yes, you did. Ducks are crazy. I saw some ducks yesterday. They were crazy. Gosh. They were all, all over the place. They were crazy. If it looks like a duck and quacks like a duck, don't take things at face value. It's <laughs> it might not be a duck. <laughs> Great Duck Rebellion. Yep. Welcome to Night Vale. God damn it. <laughs> I've actually gone to a live recording of Night Vale. I don't even know what Night Vale is. That was the first time I ever saw and technically heard an episode of Night Vale during a live recording. It's a podcast about a fictional community radio station where all this weird paranormal shit happens. It's like every conspiracy theory you can think of is, true. is actually happening with them. Yeah. So telling me that JFK shot Lee Harvey Oswald, not the other way around. Uh, and now he's on the moon fighting Fu Manchu for control of the Earth of the Moonite. Sure. It's all, it's all in my book, it's really. Hey, Duke. The, the Sheriff's Secret Police will be by hey, later Duke? to check up on you. Hey, Duke. Do yeah, me a yes. favor. Go up on top of this building. Alone. You better do what she says. Yeah, go up on top of this building alone for me, please. Thank you. Yeah, let me just come to grips with I'm my uh, problem with <laughs> heights. Inevitable demise. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're behind me. Okay. Well then. Behind you. Yeah. Oh wait, no, they're also in front of me. I think Not I heard bad. something. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh, that was the best Midwest accent I've ever done. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Uh, oh, because no, I know why, because I'm sounding like Sarah Palin. Oh dear. There we go. I'll just like, watch a bunch of Sarah Palin images and copy the Midwest accent from her. 
Fire, uh, Scarlet! Fire! Fire. Scarlet, you used the flamethrower. I killed it. it. I killed it. It was death. super effective. So dead. That was really bad at Pokemon. I just leveled my starter. I didn't give a shit about any other Pokemon in like my party. Like I had captured like a Caterpie and a Rattata, Ooh. but I never touched them ever. So like yeah, by Elite Four, I'd have like a level 90 Charizard, and everyone else was level five. X-ray down. I killed it. It is dead. Now I think there's just one behind me, okay. somewhere. You're just like. I don't care if Brock's Pokemon are resistant to fire. I'm gonna use tackle and scratch the whole time. By <laughs> being fire type in the beginning of Pokemon, oh, is that I found the aliens! Much, uh, I found the aliens! Because the first two gyms kick your ass super hard. I found the aliens! Or beating rock type. Yeah, I mean, there's rock type, and then Misty's water type, so it's like you got two hurdles to jump over. Guys, I found the aliens. Five. Good job. Find the aliens. Okay, found them. Good job. I don't care which version you start with, red, blue, or yellow, and whatever Pokemon you get, Missy Starmie was still a bastard the entire time. I don't, I don't even, I don't even remember it. I, I never really particularly had any troubles with like the, the first, like the generation one gyms. I just remember generation two, when you get the golden on you fight Whitney and then Miltank. Miltank was crazy. Tank uses rollout, yeah. your team dies instantly. Roll out, one it go, roll out, one it go. She shot like 10 feet away from him! Did she miss? Yes. Nice job. <laughs> it's super effective. We need to use this full restore. That, see, he's like, you're not a good trainer, you just use items. You have money, that's why you're good. <sighs> okay, let's see if she can hit this time. Uh, Butterfree on Brock. No, I had yellow version, so I had to catch a Mankey instead. All them fight moves. Aye, aye, Commander. I think I'm planning on doing that as lock run at some point. Got a 43% chance to hit. <laughs> and loud. she missed. Alright, that's not good as I like. I'm using the cloud. You know, you know what I hated was that bug catching contest in Generation 2. It's like, I got I remember that. 100 B drill, but I just lost to someone who caught a level 3 Caterpie. <laughs> Apparently Beedrill sucks. <laughs> I was thinking of James Kill it! Second. Kill it dead! Which they're nope. filming the new movie. Which I'm she shot movie. about 10 feet away as well. I thought Kingsman was the new Bond movie. No, that's that's not the <laughs> movie. <laughs> um, yeah, your people don't have, seem to have good eyes. I guess. Hey, so let's nobody's... Let's not make fun of my visual impediments here. So nobody's dead yet. I think your team needs glasses. Hey! My team does not need glasses. They seem to be missing it like five feet away though. Shush. Aye aye, Commander! Ooh, that's not that bad. It's, not it's right. okay, I'm here to kill all the aliens. Mission accomplished. Aye aye, Commander. Yes, she's a pirate. Aye aye, Commander. Aye aye, Commander! Lily, Lily. <laughs> I'm a pirate. I never understood why. I don't. I never really liked Pirates of the Caribbean because they glorify pirates, and it's like, dude, pirates are huge assholes. We've got to support. We've got to support now. We've got to support. They make everyone around them good. And we've got our first badge. Dun da 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 da. You got the Pewter City Gym badge. Except I didn't. Except you did, job. You and award medals in the barracks. Now you need seven more to compete in the in the Pokemon League. Okay, Sky is way, way, way too loud right now. We're on the road to being terrorized by the aliens. What's too loud? We're not gonna be there for a long time. My Skype was at a hundred percent when you were talking, and they're just like, ow, my brain. There we go. Hundred percent. Okay. Try training in gravity at 2,000% gravity. 2,000% when, gravity. When we get the proper badge, we also had to rename it. The one for, uh, you know, someone Commander getting killed. The situation room. It has to be named after me the memorial the badge. Room. Yeah, that was a good one. I heard of that. You've got there Christy. Were, like, uh, Gary had 10 badges and an 8 badge reason. That was so good. Like, damn, Gary. You're really good. You got two badges that don't even exist. <laughs> oh, Gary. Hold on, I'm making Kirsty. Oh, okay. 
Oh, and they're British. You should put Sweetie in there too. Why not? Who? Sweetie. Uh, we I'll are put not in there later. playing co-op. And Destroyer. Destroyer. Commander to the situation we... room. She is only playing the game. You can have a spiffy hat. And us two idiots are just along for the ride. Yeah. Bright blue eyebrows. And we we could be called the advisory panel, but uh, advisory panel. That, you know we that's are that's giving us too much respect. Yeah, there. They're the they're horrible at advising. Were were those two guys who were in the in the Muppet like the observation booth of the opera, like those two old Muppet guys who just laugh at everything? Oh, their names escape me. Yeah, their names escape me too. But were those guys? <laughs> Or okay, in like Star Wars Episode One, where that commentator Commander for the, the pod race is like room. that guy with two heads. Commander to the situation mm. room. Oh, Stafford Waldorf. That's their name. I don't even remember. What should we call the urban combat badge? If it's gonna give me a plus five to defense in cover. I don't know. That's Do crazy remember? how there's like a fedora for. Rogue. I can't remember what we called it last time. Got some. Got me. Yeah. Oh, Sarah is going to Manchester in six months. Awesome. I get to see Sarah. I am already here. Okay, let's call it the... Hide... The, the hide bitch. Hide bitch metal. <laughs> oh. There we go. Commander so far, I think Manchester room. is very Commander to cold the situation and room. cloudy. Let's award it to... Duke. <laughs> so Duke doesn't die. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> Pulling out all the stops to save uh, Duke. From hey, the Duke has never made it through an entire campaign. Wait. Yeah, and these cloning costs are starting to rise. <laughs> yeah, I don't so care what cloning. universe you're from that gotta hurt, you mean that dude pepper. I don't even know what I said. <laughs> okay, now we can go to the situation the right? council is going to want satellite coverage. So we should plan our deployments carefully. Okay. Let's see here. Let's launch a satellite. Do we want to launch a satellite over India or Russia? Hey, so to put it over Russia so Putin's not like, hey, don't put a well, satellite. Out of, out of the two, Russia gives us more money and it gives us scientists per month. Yeah, the Russian scientists are probably really hot. Countries in Europe, yes. Facilities at It'll also make sure that I'll also make sure I start getting more money so I can start getting more stuff. We still got some room to grow up here. But still if we don't have enough to, to build another satellite uplink though. We need engineers. We're going to have to start excavating beneath the base. Engineers. We need engineers. More more We need lots of most strong traditional pilots. Oh, I have one steam vent. <laughs> Russia, ba, ba, while this whole thing is going on, Putin's just out there, like, boxing the aliens. I'm riding a bear. Yes, we are going to Russia, da? Running them over and eating them. We have now done xenobiology. You're telling me that we should risk the of our troops so we can take one of In these things In other words, we just prodded alive. the alien this yes. time. Yes. Without a live specimen, I'm afraid and we've like, reached right, the pinnacle of what my team is able to accomplish. Cutscene! <laughs> And how do you suggest we do uh, this? Yeah, I'm not going the autopsy I've just that. completed confirms but, that the alien's physiology is quite but similar to our pepper. A highly concentrated electrical oh, current do. delivered at close range should cause neuromuscular. Close range? And what happens if it doesn't work? Do you really think this is worth the risk? Yes. I do. We do not know yes. our enemy. I'm I'm how replying to the cutscene. Stop something that oh. I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> if we can capture one of these creatures Sorry, alive, it's behind. we I can't may be able on. to... You keep forgetting that I'm playing a game. <laughs> and no, it's like, I don't even know when the cuts are happening. I'm so uh, far behind. Find out what they uh. want. Where they're operating Tasers. From. Yes. That's all you need to know. Tasers, <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm making tasers. In my opinion. Okay. I can construct a safe enough facility to house our captive, but I do not know how we could possibly communicate with it. Not to worry. I will see to that. They oh, never explain how you communicate the with the aliens. They Do never we really want to know how Volan communicates with the aliens? <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, cutscene's over. Prob probably like reading like different shades of gray. Aliens wrote that book. Okay, hey, let's. Now, now she can, she can use the movie sectoid. too. We've made a number of interesting discoveries. You wish it was Helena from DOA now. <laughs> 
Yeah. I've never played Dead or Alive. To this well, well, okay, well, obviously, I think mean, you would know all the tricks in Dead or Alive. Based on the unusual mind. structure of its internal organs, I think that's the most defining feature about that game. To be the and Helena is like one of the hot, like, really sexualized ones. I think she's like a media stuff. Oh, that's Christy. You know he's got a poster that he keeps just off camera. A blink. Hey, we got a blink for the thing with the stuff. Helena from RE, right? Um, <laughs> RE6? I don't remember that. She was okay. Let's research this alien materials. This has a number of potential applications. I'm sure the science Oops. team is eager to begin. That one. I'll notify you as soon. Oh no! Wait, Helena's Helena's the. Uh, is that the, the cowgirl check? I think it's cowgirl. Uh oh. Cowgirl. Yeah. Launch! Launch the interceptors! The interceptors. Oh, okay, no, that's not. Helen is a different one. A French one. Douglas. I have still not played or seen RE6, and I probably won't. We have eyes on the bandits. It's okay. She's a French cowgirl. Oh, it is. Is she cowgirl? She's not cowgirl. No, she's just French. Come on, you can do it. Yeah, we French have taken down. Singer. We have taken down our first UFO. This is Voodoo 37. We have but a UFO was no match. The UFO was no match. The UFO is down. I'll copy over. Solid copy. I'm Voodoo such a scrub. I'm nice such you. I play all the guy characters. All right, people. Retest I'm not the internet. That's not how you're supposed we'll to play. Get me a visual on that me. crash site. She's coming into range now, sir. On screen. I'm clapping in happiness. Magnify. Yes, that is Magnify. I don't think that's how the satellite works, really. Still in one piece. At least not like that. Commander, I recommend we get a strike team to the crash site immediately. You're not supposed to know the satellite works like that. <laughs> Look like that. Yeah. Like, wait a minute. Send the Sky Ranger. But don't send anyone on it. Just send the Sky Ranger. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> but then who's flying it? Automated. Ghost, ghost of Christmas let's take, past. Let's take. It's actually space ghost. <laughs> space ghost. Why space ghost? <laughs> Can I interview the interviewer? Big Marcus. 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 The Newman. guy who originally voiced space ghost passed away. Was Did he? I don't know. I haven't watched space ghost in a long time. He, he voiced space ghost in the original cartoon, not coast to coast. Do, 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 uh, do, 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 do. Okay, let's never, launch the mission. Launching the mission. <laughs> Gary Owens was his name. Gary Owens. Yeah, he died. Destroying yeah, land. yeah, he okay, died. Just wow. Begin assault. Three, three days ago. Let's see here. Let's he did powder and toast, man. Louder. There we go. Just press the piece to him. It looks like the aliens went down <coughs> to a sparsely populated area. If there are civilians in the area, I hope they stay clear. Well, when Hel Leon Helen could go to, shall they change their outfit? So my lovely advisors, do you guys have any advice? For... Don't get me killed. Well, there's that, and in a serious sense, just move very slowly. This is big <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, like the best advice in this game is just to move super slowly. Move super slowly. And just like keep everybody together. In a, like a on high ground. Yeah, in a five meter spread. Well, you can't really do that in this game, but you know the same concept. What about standing in fire? Is that good for me? Probably not. Especially in <laughs> force. That game is like, don't don't touch that fire. Yep, and then you blow up and you explode. Hello, Mr. Shadow. I found a meld! Yes. I have found a meld. A meld. A meld. A single meld. If I send in the new dude first. <laughs> Star Trek rules. He's a red shirt. Until he gets a name and a look, he is a red shirt. I just realized they're missing something from the elite soldier pack. Hmm. They need sombreros. Sombreros? Sombreros. What? No, it's sombreros. sombreros? Raiden from MGS, MGS Rising has a sombrero. <laughs> sombreros, oh, and it's gotta have the right facial hair to go with them. Yeah, he's gotta have that mustache. A curly mustache. The, yeah, the, ster the stereotype stash? And a poncho. Mm, yeah. Look at those aliens running with the tails between their legs. <laughs> we do hey. need a Barry Burton, since Necro said he's not going to do Barry Burton. I don't think Necro could pull off Barry Burton. <laughs> no one can tear off Barry Burton except Barry Burton. 
We need to find Bur a man named Barry Burton then. Probably someone there named Barry Burton. He doesn't even know who Barry Burton is. Unless he's ever met a Resident Evil fan ever. Oh gosh, no, I'm good. He probably owns a sandwich shop too. You're doing G Generation, Claire? Go ahead! I'm doing, um, Dark Side Chronicle, Claire. I didn't watch any of the, yeah, uh, the, um, CG on Moving to designated coordinates. And then I'm gonna go find myself a Steve, Burns Steve Burnside, and I'm going to be happy. Steve Burnside. I ship Steve and Claire so hard. Well, too bad he's dead! He's not dead! Pretty sure he's dead. He's not dead. Pretty sure. He's sleeping with the fishes. Right. Okay, first off, it's we're talking about Capcom here. And Capcom. Wesker, Wesker literally says he might come back to, like, bother your sister or something. He literally says that. Capcom. <laughs> Marvel vs. Capcom 4. Well, they're probably not gonna do that. Come on, Street Fighter 5 scene, though. Kill it, Kirsty! Failed. Uh, Damn it, Kirsty. Great dishonor to my family. She's not Chinese. That was a Japanese yeah, accent. <laughs> oh. <laughs> There we go, now it's dead. It's okay, Bacon killed it anyway. Good job, dude. Doing your part for America. America! I'm doing my part for the Federation. Wait, which Federation? Like, Star Trek Federation? Federation? Gundam Federation? All of the Federation. All of the Federation? The uh -oh. Detroit Federation? The we've Federation got, from wait, guys, it guys, goes? guys, guys, we've got four sectoids. Well, so, they're little baby monsters. Four sex crap. toys. So, like, punch them in the nuts. <laughs> Is Bacon close enough to kill them all with a- Oh my god, please tell me he's close enough. Please tell me he's close enough. Because that would be absolutely amazing if he was close enough. Duck is. To withstand an impact like that at such a velocity. The materials used in that vessel's hull must be at least Tony asks, how's your university work going? To Scarlet. What? Tony asks how your university work is going. Ah, it's going alright. I'm still behind in my computer class, but... I'm getting better. How did I go? I actually have some work. Yeah, in between the fraternity parties. Or the sorority yeah, parties. Ew! Like, why? Yeah, why would I, I ever it. even think about going to one of those Yeah, things? I don't think hell? Scarlet's the one that would be that. Yeah, neither. But... I think that would be probably a good it. <laughs> Boof. Smoke grenade to make sure Boof- To make sure Duke is protected. <laughs> so smoke grenade and it's like, it's pot. <laughs> <laughs> no! That'd be great! <laughs> all the no. aliens get high. Plays it with the aliens. Plays in it all day. No, I have to get the chem med research to do that. That's right, it's red. Okay, nobody's been hit yet, but they've still got three dudes. I just gotta hope nobody gets flanked. Oh no, Bacon's- Oh. Bacon got flanked and got hit with a six, uh, six damage critical. What shall I know yo? We just lost Duke okay. of Bacon. Really? Yep. Oh. He got flanked I and got crit it. he got flanked and got critted twice because we have that flanking or had that crit thing on. Man, dude. I am not sorry about your death at all. <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> I'll be back. And that means we lose that medal too. It was awesome. I was in the hotel room like two days ago, and I was chilling, and the Terminator 2 was on. That was amazing. I watched that the whole night. Hey, you guys were the ones who wanted me to get the critical thing on. Well, it was mostly Duke. I didn't, I didn't really see it. Yeah, he, pay off. He, yeah, he, didn't it just kill you? <laughs> hey, accidents happen. <laughs> <laughs> sure, that's what it was. And Kirstie is a failure at shooting. 
Somebody needs to go to the fire range, which I don't that think they have. That was a very you stupid pitch. decision of you, Mr. Mr. Alien. Uh, he just mind melded like another alien, except the one that did the mind melding has one HP. Uh, God. We're just gonna have to look at this one way here. I died so that Scarlet would be shot at. <laughs> That's what every loyal assistant lackey meat shield should do. That's, I guess that is true. The minion's job. Nah, you Aren't just died because uh, you got flanked. Reminds me of Overlord. I can't believe I played that game. The game is weird. I have never played Overlord. So it's okay. It's like, it's like really just dark humor and like decent gameplay. It's... Nice fedora, by the way, Kirsty. Yeah, Fedora's got. She's got a. She's got a pretty good Fedora. You have some Bacon interesting decisions to make very soon. Either you find yourself a, a Ronnie right away, you bring me back, or you put Pepper in second in command there. I didn't even know I was in the squad. Not yet. Not yet, you aren't. But that is also going to be the end of this video for YouTube, at least. My mm. name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I'm joined by. Yeah, at the same time. At the same time. <laughs> but I want to change it up because you went first. You know, you just gotta go down. And I'll see you all.